Viva Maria, Viva Victoria, Aphrodita. It's Monday morning, May the 4th, 1998, in Birmingham's National Indoor Arena. 25 nations gather for the week to attempt to win the world's biggest campus song contest. On stage, Greece are next to rehearse. Okay. It's only day one, but already their composer, Yanis Valvis, is not a happy man. Uh, I'm disappointed with uh, this organized here. I'm the, direct, I'm the composer of the song. And I, content, I protest about all of this. That's why I'm not in the screen to play. In this room, every country watches a recording of their song and can voice their thoughts on the way the BBC is televising the performance. And it can be war. With a Greek tragedy brewing, they've called in reinforcements Mike Lego, the boss of BBC Light Entertainment, to protect the show's director, who is locked away in the control room. Look at this. Make the play. The doily upper. One, two, three, four, five, six. What are these moves? I need six shots to, to, to give a beat to, 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 to the music. Stop this. Dana has announced that she doesn't care if she wins or loses. Hmm. If that's true, why has she brought so many personal advisors? Hairstylist, makeup, costume designer, choreographer, voice coach. It seems like all of TV Tel Aviv has come to Birmingham to put in their two pennies worth. Mind you, when it comes to opinions, others aren't short of a few bob. Yes. I think generally you'll agree that... Um, no. The main... You don't know what I'm going to say. Eh? No, it's possible to believe it. You can go with camera up. In, in a basketball... Uh, I'm very sorry. In my video clip, there's only one director and, I'm very, I'm and one photographer. Can, can we look this, this video clip, please? You can, you can Maybe they'd listen to him if he bought a TV license. With only one camera. There is only one director and one camera crew, oh. there cannot be 25 directors oh. and there cannot be 25 it's camera crews. It's funny. Yeah. It's funny. Yeah. Listen, yeah. we're in European community like you. I don't, I don't want for you to, to talk to us with a colonial behavior. Do we, do we have to receive all these uh, effects? effects? It's too much. Yeah, it's too much. Yeah, I now there's a delay that goes with the song, which is 447 milliseconds. Are you going to run into the audience? Yes. Yeah. Right. Back at the arena, rehearsals are in full swing again. Mr. Anti-Fashion Gildo Horn from Germany has come with a reputation for anarchic outrage. Yeah, I'll test it. Though. Don't go, don't go mad now. Don't, don't do too much, but I'll test it later on. Do it. Uh, oh. But, as any anarchist will tell you, anarchy takes a lot of careful planning. OK, so that gives us a rough idea, and then, then you just yeah. improvise. Locked away in his control room, the BBC's director, Jeff Posner, has to make sure it's all going to appear on screen. Turkish song is the result of months of hard work for the composer, weeks huddled over the manuscript for the arranger, extensive rehearsal by the conductor and the culmination of a lifetime preparation for the singer, Tuzman. After all that hard work, you'd have thought they'd have bothered to time it. Three? Three seconds over. And how much rehearsal time have we got left? We've got six minutes left. Well, the only option now is to play the notes faster. It is, look. It's got hemi demi semi quavers. It's got septapular hemi demi semi dim dams and clusters of those. And what are they? Difficult. Not everyone has time to party. After all, this competition is a big number. When it's televised, over 100 million people will be watching. It needs to look really spectacular. Now, let's see a bill there. And now what does that leave? It's 23 to go, doesn't it? It's going to be a long night. It's going to be a long night. Tuzman's going to have to get all his emotion into three minutes, with a little help from the band, though no one seems quite sure how. sound very good. I mean, most of the tracks that we're playing on have got click tracks where you, 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 you work into a solid metre and all that. So it's going to be the sa exactly the same every time, but this hasn't, so... And you, uh, it wouldn't be right to play it as a click track. Too... Romantic. 
performers aren't the only ones still struggling to get their act together. In the gap between the German and Maltese entries, the stage crew have to bring off a whole kit of instruments and replace them with a forest of candles. All in 30 seconds. Speed and candle wax are not a happy mix. It's all over my glasses, isn't it? And me. I've been dancing. What did I do? It's one of the Greeks' final rehearsals. Not content just to be the spokesman, Yanis is now on stage himself. Why? Yanis has been refused entry to the arena and disqualified from the contest. Well, they're in a meeting at the moment to see whether they're going to go on. So um, I think if they don't go on, France are just going to go on instead of them. They're due on in two minutes. <laughs> Unfortunately, Yanis, uh, the Greek composer, just didn't heed the formal request from EBU and us. We said, please don't walk onto the stage during rehearsal. Uh, he did it again, and uh, we have, we've had to withdraw his accreditation. It just comes a point where you just think, well, the security of the show becomes first, and that's it. After a long meeting to discuss the disqualification of Yanis, Greece are suddenly back in the green room they have decided to perform without him. Nightmare. But if they don't make it on stage in time for their dress rehearsal, Greece will be out of the competition altogether. Hold on. And the clock is ticking. Hi, I, I need you round here now, because you, you're on in one minute. OK. to Andrea. This is it. Well, nothing happens in Birmingham normally. You're going to something special, that my favourite it's brilliant for Birmingham. It's a good, it's a good boost for it's Birmingham. It's just nice really. that it's in Birmingham because, you know, we live here and that's it. It's finally time for the Eurovision Song Contest itself. Welcome all to paraphrase the football song. The Eurovision's coming home, home to Birmingham, the second city, the hub, the driving force of Britain's great industrial revolution. Birmingham hosts the 43rd running of the great Eurovision Song Contest handicap. And when all the tumult and the shouting of this extravaganza has died down, next week it will host G8, a meeting of all the world's most powerful leaders. What a place. Just to show you how important that is, Bill Clinton will be taking over the very bedroom that I've just vacated in a hotel here. I wonder if it's all not going to be too much. But this city can handle it. Their motto is forward. They've got the ideal site. One of the very few places in Europe could stage a contest of this preposterous magnitude. The National Indoor Arena. 25 countries taking part this year. You can probably hear the clash of ego and temperament from where you're sitting. Now look, lads, much as I'd like to, I can dally no longer in a desperate effort to save a bob or two. Ooh, the BBC have me doing ten men's work. So, excuse me, I have a 200-yard dash to make from here to the stage. Where's me running shoes?
boil it down to a dull roar. The rest of Europe thinks the British are reserved. Bonsoir, mesdames et messieurs. Bienvenue à 43 e concours Eurovision de la chanson en direct de la National Indoor Arena à Birmingham. Welcome. Okay. Okay, so I learned it off by heart. Welcome to the millions of you watching, to the performers from 25 countries waiting nervously backstage, and to the 4,000 fans and supporters gathered here in Birmingham's wonderful National Indoor Arena tonight to celebrate the 43rd Eurovision Song Contest suitably enough on Europe Day 1998. And this contest, of course, as you'll have gathered, is a massive annual event, a far cry indeed from the BBC's first Eurovision in 1960. Ladies and gentlemen, you have met the artists, and here on this giant scoreboard beside me, you can see the title of the song they're going to sing and the countries they represent. So at this point, I will hand you over to a team of international commentators who will each describe their scene on their own national audiences throughout Europe. Katie Boyle, who hosted then, went on to compare three more contests, and I'm delighted she's able to be with us here tonight. Katie Boyle. Bienvenue à ma co-présentatrice, Ulrika Johnson. Regardez plus attentivement encore le concours, car ce soir, pour la première fois, la plupart d'entre vous pourra voter pour, par téléphone pour la chanson que vous souhaitez voir gagner. Boy. Boy. Now, there are more reasons than ever to watch and listen closely to tonight's show because for the first time, the majority of you at home will be able to vote for the song you want to win by telephone. Don't worry about having to remember each song as we go along because we'll be showing you a brief reminder of all 25 along with the phone numbers just before the phone lines open. Of course, you'll not be able to vote for your own country song, you fools. Same to you, pal. <laughs> okay? You'll have nobody to blame but yourselves for tonight's result, okay? It's your fault. So there they all are, each country's spokesperson getting themselves ready. <laughs> getting themselves ready to collect and relay your votes in what's become Europe's most complex live satellite exchange. Luckily, I'm a man who smurfs the net with the best of them. So, unless the elastic band snaps somewhere between here and Europe, we're going to be all right, fingers crossed. Before things heat up, I'm off to my backstage cabin to attempt a spot of commentary for the United Kingdom. But don't build up your hopes. No, no honestly. Sorry, but I'll be back. Les artistes qui ont choisi l'orchestre de concert de le BBC seront accompagnés par celui-ci ce soir avec Martin Loveday comme premier violon et Martin Koch comme chef d'orchestre. C'est so exciting. So here are the 25 countries taking part tonight. In order of performance, that was determined by a draw here in Birmingham last November. All that remains for me to do now is to wish all the performers the very best of luck. Bon chance, bon appétit, bon voyage. And to invite you all to sit back and enjoy the 1998 Eurovision Song Contest. Well, I'm back in my box, and here's the first song. Mother told me that he was like this. 
Now these films, these little treasures, before you hear the songs, present some of the more cliched images of UK life and translate them into more contemporary equivalents. They're made by Guy Freeman, they're lovely. Football, then and now. And the first song comes from Croatia, written by Peter Grasch, and it's sung by Daniela, who I think her first loveliness may well surprise you. It's called May the Sun Never Rise, which may not be the most optimistic theme. There's the flag of Croatia. Good opener, this strong orchestral sound. BBC Concert Orchestra, conducted by Stefan Kaloyera. Daniela. <laughs> Svane mi dane Red Arrows, 10 Hawk aircraft based in Cranwell and Lincolnshire. Watch how they paint the Tricolor for France. Cementing the Entente Courier. The heart. Now we move to France. Le coup de ta victoire seul peut le dessiner. Tu n'es pas le premier. L'espoir va t'encourager. Si tu pars, tu relances. Si tu flanches, tu renonces. Tu n'as pas le coup à aller.
one is the one that's got well half of all the publicity the other half has gone to the song that immediately follows this this is the israeli entry from dana international a very far cry from the fine young lady who attempted to be president of ireland last year dana international is different and so is gildo he's coming up next so get ready for eurovision with the difference Wasn't even wearing a polo neck. This is going to set tongues a wagging all over Europe. Climbs all over the set like he owns it. This is Stefan Rab, who's the composer and the lyricist and the conductor. Watch out for Gildo. Gildo hat euch lieb, und wenn's auch mal Tränen gibt, kommt er rüber und singt für euch Lieder. Gildo hat euch lieb. Come on! Gildo hat euch lieb. Er hat lange Gott, in der eine zum anderen hält. Und in dir deine Tränen spüren, werden Träume fliegen.
murder or a drink myself at this moment. I hope they're not going to have a succession of drinkers or people eating themselves silly. And again, by way of contrast, London Fashion Week. Jason Paul Cassar is the composer. The music, Sonny Aquilina. It's a great name, isn't it? He's the lyricist. Chiara's the singer of the Maltese entry. I've been lucky enough to draw Slovenia in the little raffle that we've had, and I'm beside myself with excitement at the prospect of winning. Will the God Set Me Free is the title, this is sung by Vidi Resnik. This is pubs through the years, 1900s, 1930s. People knew how to dress then. Then the modern day will be coming up. All well, points are the same, thank goodness. Matthias Vlasic is the composer, and Ursa Vlasic is the lyricist. When Will the Gods Set Me Free, Vili Resnik, born in Ljubljana. This is Ocean Drive by the Lighthouse family backing it. Let's see how the, the colours rack up here. <laughs> Moimir Seppe is the conductor. It's the BBC Concert Orchestra playing for all the contestants. record in this contest is so distinguished and they've won it so often that you can never dismiss their chances so I'm certainly not going to do it now the lady singing for them is Dawn born from in Dundalk in County Loud just 21 she's got a big voice she could be straight out of the commitments this girl and we're introducing the Irish song views of London do I have to uh, cannery wharf there Bittersweet Symphony by the Verb is the music. It's always over now, which is uh, my sentiments too, is the Irish song. It's written by Jerry Morgan, who's the composer and the lyricist, and that's a clever way of getting the Irish trick on isn't it? That's Noel Keelan, who's been doing this longer than I have.
from ancient to modern here. This is the Mansfield Green Junior Infant School in Birmingham. Backing music is beautiful ones by Suede. Alma Lusa is the Portuguese group. The music is by Jose Cid. And the conductor is uh, an Englishman, Mike Sargent, who's conducted for Portugal before now. This will do Portugal well, this song. And uh, it's full of fine things like bagpipes and mandolins and melodians. do mundo a gente de Portugal com saudade de alguém que deixou alguém do outro lado do mar se eu te pudesse abraçar e depois falar contigo tinha tanta coisa para te contar meu irmão e meu amigo caminhar, caminhar baixo caminho Distância faz chorar Navegar, navegar Sobre a terra, sobre o mar É preciso acreditar Se eu te pudesse abraçar E sempre mais sai Da paz puta Here it is, United Kingdom song 16. We're well over halfway through that. It's only ten past nine. On wings of song. Now the theme, you won't need the likes of me to tell you, is the mini. 1959, the first one came out. And I suppose as popular as ever. You can burn some rubber in a mini. Now the United Kingdom entry, in case you've been down a hole in the ground for the last six months, is Where Are You? It's going to be sung by Imani from Nottingham lived most of her life in Derby, young life. The composer is Brooklyn-born Scott English and Simon Sterling and Phil Manikiza. Hey. Straight out of top gear, this. Where's Big Jeremy when we really need him? Whoopee, there he is. He's driving the white mini. James McMillan's the conductor of the crowd, already going wild. Let's hear it for Imani and the United Kingdom. Let's make it two on the trot. Where are you? I see a picture in a frame. I see a place without a name. Riding alone on an empty train. Where are you? Live in a house of broken hearts.
Good performance from Imani. Where are you? Could do it again. Thank you. Why wouldn't everybody in the BBC be pleased with that? Opportunity to spend a bit more of your money there. Now, the set, as I've said, is by distinguished designer, but the direction of this is Eurovision is by Jeff Posner. BAFTA award-winning Jeff Posner. I knew when he was nothing. Tô que ser o capo mesta sua teki E a sinori bangos mi areti Celia for the Netherlands. Broadcast technology is our theme here. First BBC outside broadcast from another country linking France and Britain was successfully attempted in 1950. Was that Eminem? Was there? The man with the dish. And look, this is a sign you don't see too often. Vive l'Angleterre. <laughs> Modern technology, of course, completely different. We've all sorts of sophisticated performers, excellent people presenting the programmes. I like, I like them very much to do this kind of thing. It's a good example coming up in just a moment now. There you are, you see. Netherlands, Heaven on Earth is the song. As I say, I think this girl's got one of the best voices in the contest. Got to take a good one to beat it. The composer, lyricist, Eric van Tijn and Joachim Flitsma. That's Dick Bakker, who's conducted many a time and off for the Netherlands. Celia Romble for the Netherlands. That's a terrific song. Great rhythm there. Too good for the Eurovision, do you think? What a thought. In the Je veux me chauffer au bois de ton sourire. On va remplir l'espace de nos éclats oui. Un jour il faut pouvoir partir. Dis oui. Tu sais c'est beau la terre du oui. Quand on est solidaire et puis le monde est à vous faire. Et 
quelque chose a changé dans le ciel ce matin. Finland. Ori Avalati is the conductor. This should be the Greek country. This girl is dressed like Penelope. And watch, there's a wealth of bizarre instruments. And there's a fellow playing a Grecian urn in this as well. Always full of interest. From Vlado Janevsky for the former Republic, oh sorry, the former Yugoslavian Republic of Macedonia. Ah, there you are. Quick sniff of the seaweed and a rocket goes off behind your ear. Strong taste. Talk about the X-Files. Forecasting. The weather. Ah, the old reliable topic. Now then. The opening song, if you cast your mind back all those years ago, was the Croatian, May the Sun Never Rise. And the closing song is called, Somebody Stop the Dawn. So, if it's gone dark over Bill's mother's, you'll know the reason why. That's the flag. Grigor Koprov's the composer. Alexander Jambatsov. There he is, the man himself, the conductor. BBC Concert Orchestra playing. Somebody stop the dawn, the final song, this year's Eurovision. Yes, more. 
song, Vlado Janewski. Did I say that with a surge of relief? No. Former Yugoslavian Republic of Macedonia, that's it. Well, what was your favourite, lads? You've seen them all. I think Malta, Ireland, UK, Netherlands, Sweden, best outsider, well, maybe Belgium. Well, congratulations and well done to all 25 countries for their magnificent performances. Now they've done their bit, it's over to you, the viewers, to decide the winner. So the number is 0891 980 Four, oh one, oh two, oh three, oh four, etc. You just change the last two digits to the number of the song you want to vote for. Hey, that's what I love about the Eurovision. No partisan feeling whatsoever. And the lines are now open for five minutes. Les lignes téléphoniques sont maintenant ouvertes pendant cinq minutes. Cinq. Vous pouvez téléphoner dès maintenant. For my second song this evening, no. The telephone numbers will only work in their country of origin. They cannot be dialed internationally, so don't even try it, okay? Now, while you decide on a winner, Time to sit back and enjoy a fine farrago, a great coming together, a magnificent muesli that reflects in all its glory the multiracial, multi-musical society that is the United Kingdom today. by Jeff Posner. There he is, Martin Kosh, conducted the BBC Concert Orchestra. Well, we're getting used to great interval acts, and that was one of the greats. Even this young lady, cool Swede, is impressed. Well, ladies and gentlemen, what an absolutely stupendous performance. The phone lines are now closed. 
In 45 minutes, one of tonight's songwriters will be holding this stunning silver and gold trophy designed by Anon Karat Onyawong at the Birmingham School of Jewellery. Tout est contrôlé en détail par Christine Marshall Ortiz de l'Union Européenne de Radio Télévision. Bonsoir Christine, ça va? Bonsoir Enrica. Tell me, um, how has the vote been going? The vote has gone just fine and the Eurovision uh, network now is on place. So good luck everybody. Yes, the very best of luck. If anything's going to go wrong, it's going to go wrong now. Now, each country will award points in the usual way, from 1 to 8 points, then 10 points and a top mark of 12. If there's a tie for first place at the end of the voting, then we'll see which country scored the most 12s and then ultimately the most 10s. Our performers are waiting eagerly backstage in the green room, looking as if they're having a very relaxing time, where they will learn their fate. Now, our computer graphics will guide us around Europe as we visit each country in performance order. So let's get the show on the road. Let's begin by calling Croatia. Dobro večer, Davor. Dobra večer, Urlika. Hello, Birmingham. Zaro uh, We would like to thank you for this beautiful show tonight. Congratulations to all the participants. But as we know, someone has to win. So uh, we do have the results of the Croatian vote. Thank you. Shall I? Yes, you shall. You shall. I'm quickly, lad. Spain, one point. Spain, one point. L'Espagne, un point. Ireland, Two points. Ireland, two points. L'Irlande, deux points. Slovenia, three points. Slovenia, three points. La Slovenie, points. Don't forget, I have this in the raffle. Cyprus, four points. Cyprus, four points. Chypre, quatre points. Turkey, five points. Turkey, five points. La Turquie, cinq points. Former Yugoslav Republic of Macedonia, six points. Well, well, there is a certain amount of what could only be described as um, partiality creeping in already. Malta, seven points. Malta, seven points. Malta, seven points. Slovakia, eight points. Slovakia, eight points. La Slovakia, eight points. Netherlands, ten points. Netherlands, ten points. One of the favourites, Netherlands, ten points. Who's going to get the twelve? And finally, United Kingdom. Guess who? That's a good start. I won't hear a word said against Croatia. Always admired Croatia. What a lovely country, full of discerning people and music lovers. Thank you. And we wish you all luck. Thank you very much, Babur. Causing great excitement here in Birmingham. But let's just remember that was just the result of the first vote. We now go to Greece. Kalispera Alexis. Kalispera Ulrica. Good evening, Ulrika. Good evening, Birmingham. Let me welcome you to Greece. This is Athens calling. And you've done a wonderful job. Congratulations. Thank you. Can we have the results of your vote, please? Yes. <laughs> but before I give the results, let me wish uh, to all the participants good luck. Thank you. So here, here are the results of the Greek vote. Portugal, one point. Portugal, one point. Le Portugal, un point. Slovenia, two points. Slovenia, two points. La Slovenie, deux points. Germany, three points. Germany, three, three points. Three for Gildo, the elusive. Belgium, four points. Belgium, four points. La Belgique, quatre points. Croatia, five points. Malta, six points. Malta, I six said Malta is going to do well, and I think points. it will. The United Kingdom, seven points. The United Kingdom, seven points. That's pretty United decent. Still in the lead. Netherlands, eight points. The Netherlands, eight points. The Pays-Bas, eight points. Only by one point. Israel, ten points. Israel, ten points. Ghana International. 
Cyprus 12 points. And Cyprus, and Cyprus 12, 12 points. points. And, uh, that's okay, I like Cyprus. Nice and sunny this time of the year. <laughs> Thank you very much. Meza and the restaurants. Thank you very much. Let's go straight to France now, and uh, I can say with great pleasure, bonsoir Marie. Bonsoir Ulrika. Bonsoir Birmingham. Ici Paris qui va accueillir la Coupe du Monde dans quelques jours. Et voici le résultat du vote de la France. Ah, merci. Marie Miriam Hongrie, represented uh, France in the Eurovision Song Contest Hongrie, some years ago. Un point. Hungary, one point. Pologne, deux points. Pologne, deux points. Poland, two points. Royaume-Uni, trois points. Le Royaume-Uni, trois points. They're not too keen United with that. Kingdom, they were lucky to get three points, points from the French. Espagne, I think that's the most they've ever given points. us, isn't it? Espagne, quatre points. Spain, four points. Pays-Bas, cinq points. Les Pays-Bas, cinq points. The Netherlands, five points. That puts the Netherlands one point Malte, ahead of the United Kingdom. Points. Malte, six points. Malta, six points. Belgique, sept points. Belgique, sept points. Belgium, seven points. Croatie, huit points. Croatie, huit points. Croatia, eight points. Portugal, dix points. Portugal, dix points. Portugal, ten points. Et enfin, Israël, 12 points. Et Israël, 12 points. 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 Israël, 12 <laughs> Me either. <laughs> Can we have your results, please, Belen? Yes. Um, this is the result of the Spanish televoting. Turkey, one point. Turkey, one point. La Turquie, un point. Croatia, two points. Croatia, two points. La Croatie, deux points. Estonia, three points. Estonia, three points. L'Estonie, trois points. First set of points for Estonia. United Kingdom, four points. The United Kingdom, four points. The United Kingdom started strongly, points. but appears to be tailing off. Netherlands, five points. The Netherlands, five points. Les Pays-Bas, cinq points. Malta, six points. Malta, six points. Malta, six points. Portugal, seven points. Portugal, seven points. Le Portugal, sept points. Belgium, eight points. Belgium, this is my little outsider, Belgium. Belgium. Watch out for Belgium and Norway, Malta. Ten points. Norway, oh, ten points. Oh, that's the fellow with Robbie Williams trousers. And finally, twelve points for Israel. Israel. That's another twelve for Israel. Is that the third deux points they've had? Puts them well in the lead now. Israel well ahead there on 34 and next up is the Netherlands very closely followed by the United Kingdom and now it's time to go to Switzerland Guten Abend Regula Guten Abend Ulrika Hello Birmingham good evening Zurich calling and I'd really have to say it was a wonderful show congratulations Thank you Are you ready We are very very ready Okay here are the results of the Swiss jury. Norway, one point. Norway, one point. La Norvège, un point. Ireland, two points. Ireland, two points. L'Irlande, deux points. The United Kingdom, three points. The United Kingdom, three points. Le Royaume-Uni, trois points. The last few set of points Belgium, have been very disappointing. four points. Belgium, four points. La Belgique, quatre points. Croatia, five points. Croatia, five points. La Croatie, cinq points. Spain, six points. Spain, six points. L'Espagne, six points. The Netherlands, seven points. The Netherlands, seven points. Les Pays-Bas, sept points. Malta, eight points. Malta, eight points. Malte, huit points. That Israel, puts Malta above the United points. Kingdom. Israel, Ten points for Israel. Who's going to get the 12? And finally, Germany. 12 points. 
Germany. Germany, 12, Germany, 12 points. points. <laughs> Get out of here. Well, that's what gives it its ar arcane, esoteric charm, the Eurovision Song Contest. The scoring. Hello, Ulrika. Good evening, Birmingham. And happy birthday to our conductor. Oh, we didn't know. Your show is really beautiful, and here are the results of ah. Slovak jury and vote. First point, United Kingdom. United Kingdom, one point. Royaume-Uni, un point. Portugal, two points. Portugal, two points. Portugal, two points. Former Yugoslavian Republic of Macedonia, three points. The former Yugoslav Republic of Macedonia, three points. L'ex République Yugoslave de Macedoine, trois points. Ireland, four points. Ireland, four points. L'Irlande, quatre points. Cyprus, five points. Cyprus, five points. Chypre, cinq points. Netherlands, six points. The Netherlands, six points. Les Pays-Bas, six points. Belgium, seven points. Belgium, seven points. La Belgique, seven points. Estonia, eight points. Estonia, eight points. L'Estonie, eight points. Croatia, ten points. Croatia, it's ten all, points. It's always a, a surprise and a delight. Who's going to get the 12? Malta, 12 <laughs> points. Malta, it's wonderful, 12 points. isn't it? Malta, it just restores your faith in the chaos theory. Malta in the lead by one point over Israel. Thank you very much, Elena. We're and then Netherlands, Malta and then the United Kingdom in fourth place, along with Croatia and Belgium. Then Cyprus, the and then Portugal. Only one point in it. And then in third place at the moment, the Netherlands. We're now mm. going to go to Poland. Dobry wieczór, Jan. Dobry wieczór. Good evening, Birmingham. Good evening, Uli. My, you have a deep voice, haven't you? So here are the results of the Polish vote. Estonia, one point. Estonia, one point. L'Estonie, un point. Ireland, two points. Ireland, two points. L'Irlande, deux points. Sweden, three points. First Sweden, set of marks for Sweden. Three points. La Suède, they were beginning points. to panic. Norway, There's a fair few there without four any. Points. Norway, four points. La Norvège, quatre points. Netherlands, five points. Netherlands, five points. Les Pays-Bas, cinq points. Croatia, six points. I must Croatia, say Croatia is doing points. better than I La thought. Of course, had the disadvantage of being the United opening song. Kingdom, seven points. Hey, United Kingdom, seven points. A decent score for the old UK Kingdom, there. Let's hear it for Poland. Malta, eight points. Malta, eight points. Malta, eight points. Yeah, Malta. Malta was Israel. one of the tips. Ten points for Israel. Going to go in the lead by one point over Malta. And finally, Belgium, 12 points. Belgium, 12 points. La Belgique, Good outsider in fourth place, Thank pushing the United Kingdom into fifth position. Israel in the lead. Thank you very much, Jan. And without further ado, let's go to Israel. Erev Tov Igal. Erev Tov Meod Ulrika. I must say, it's a very good night here in Jerusalem, and everybody has been flattering you so much, so what can I say? We've been enjoying the show as well, all of us here on Channel One here in Jerusalem. And here is the result of the Israeli vote. Thank you. Cyprus, one point. Cyprus, one point. Chypre, un point. Portugal, two points. Portugal, two points. Portugal, deux points. Spain, three points. Spain, three points. L'Espagne, trois points. Norway, four points. Norway, four points. La Norvège, quatre points. Belgium, five points. Belgium, five points. La Belgique, cinq points. Romania, six points. Romania, six points. La Romanie, six points. First set of points for Romania. Malta, seven points. Malta, Another good score for Malta. Points. Malta, sept points. The Netherlands, eight points. The Netherlands, eight points. Les Pays-Bas, huit points. Croatia, ten points. Croatia, ten points. La Croatie, dix points. And finally, United Kingdom, twelve points. Twelve points. Boy, 
Did the United Kingdom need that one? Beginning to slip and now in fourth position. Malta in the lead. Good evening and then Israel. The Netherlands. Thank you very much. Joint second place. People. United Kingdom. Belgium. Croatia. Just taking a look now. They are Malta really the, the only ones that count and even Israel at this early stage. Closely behind alongside the Netherlands. And we've now got the United Kingdom at 49 points. And we still have four countries yet to score. Greece, France, Switzerland and Finland. Let's see if Germany can bring them any more luck. Good Abend, Nina. Hello, Ulrike. Hello, Gilda. Hello, Birmingham. The Expo City Hanover calling. We enjoyed the show very, very much. That's and here are the, resi the, the, the results <laughs> of the German vote. OK? OK. So United Kingdom, one point. They spoil us, United Kingdom, Ambassador. one point. The Royaume-Uni, one point. Ireland, two points. Ireland, two points. L'Irlande, two points. Norway, three points. Norway, three points. La Norvège, trois points. Belgium, four points. Belgium, four points. La Belgique, quatre points. Poland, five points. Poland, five points. La Pologne, cinq points. Netherlands, six points. The Netherlands, six points. Les Pays-Bas, six points. Israel, seven points. Israel, seven points. Israel, seven points. Malta, eight points. Malta, eight points. Malta, eight points. Croatia, ten points. Croatia, ten points. La Croatie, ten points. And Turkey, twelve points. And Turkey, twelve points. La Turquie, well, this points. may or may not have something to do with the fact that there are many, Nina. many thousands of Turkish Gastarbeiten in Germany. And let's go straight away to Malta, but indeed. Not for me to and suggest. Good evening, Stephanie. Hello, Ulrika. Good evening, Birmingham. This is Valletta calling. And now I would love uh, to give you the votes of the Maltese vote, in fact. Thank you. Cyprus, one point. Cyprus, one point. Chypre, un point. Portugal, two points. Portugal, two points. Portugal, two points. Belgium, three points. Belgium, three points. La Belgique, trois points. Sweden, four points. Sweden, four points. La Suède, quatre points. Norway, five points. Norway, five points. La Norvège, cinq points. Ireland, six points. Ireland, six points. L'Irlande, six points. Netherlands, seven points. Netherlands, seven points. Les Pays-Bas, sept points. United Kingdom, eight points. United Kingdom, eight points. Le Royaume-Uni, huit points. Croatia, ten points. Croatia, ten points. La Croatie, dix points. Croatia has been climbing up that and board. And finally, finally, Israel, twelve points. Hey. It's not a commanding Thanks lead. Thanks again for a fantastic Israel Thank five much. points ahead of Malta, much, and then the Netherlands one Malta point behind them, then Croatia at 66, United again. Kingdom at 58 in, there, in fifth place. Points, but three countries very, very closely behind Malta, the Netherlands, and indeed now Croatia. So let's go to Hungary, your estate, Barna. Hey, your estate, Ulrika. How are you? You look very pretty tonight. Thank you. So let's thank see you. the points. I give you 12 points. Oh, thank the you. The old Hungarian charmer. Oozing charm from every pore. He oiled himself across the floor. Okay. So let's see the official result. Cyprus is one point. Cyprus, one point. Chypre, un point. Poland, two points. Poland, two points. La Pologne, deux points. Belgium, three points. Belgium, three points. La Belgique, trois points. Estonia, four points. Estonia, four points. L'Estonie, quatre points. Norway, five points. Norway, five points. La Norvège, cinq points. Ireland, six points. Ireland, six points. L'Irlande, six points. Malta, seven points. Malta, seven points. Malta, sept points. Sweden, eight points. Sweden, eight points. La Suède, huit points. 
10 points goes to United Kingdom. Very decent, very decent. Bless you, Zoltan. And 12 points goes to the Netherlands. Oh! Okay, that's changed the old ball game a bit. The Netherlands are now in the lead. Over Malta, then Israel, United Kingdom moving up to fourth place, then Croatia. Netherlands now in the lead. Let's go straight to Slovenia. Dobrovecer Mojca. Wow, perfect. I've been practicing. Good evening, Birmingham. This is Ljubljana calling, and here are the results of the Slovenian vote. Starting with Ireland, one point. Ireland, one point. L'Irlande, un point. Estonia, two points. Estonia, two points. L'Estonie, deux points. Malta, three points. That's disappointing Malta, from Slovenia points. for Malta. Malta. Trois points. Former Yugoslavian Republic of Macedonia, Four points. The former Yugoslav Republic of Macedonia, four points. L'ex République Yugoslave de Macedoine, four points. United Kingdom, five points. The United Kingdom, five points. Le Royaume-Uni, cinq points. Belgium, six points. Belgium, six points. La Belgique, six points. Israel, seven points. Israel. Seven points. Israel, seven points. Germany, eight points. Germany, eight points. L'Allemagne, eight points. Norway, ten points. Norway, ten points. La Norvège, ten points. Ronan Keating's cousin. He's doing well. And now, I hope they will remember it very well for next time. Croatia. Oh, well, that's a little bit. Um, what's the word we're looking for? Indiscreet. Indiscreet. Oh, I wonder. Uh, I wonder just how much politics play their part in that. Israel in the lead. One point over Netherlands. Then Croatia, 78, and Malta, 78. United Kingdom in fifth place, 73. With the Netherlands just chomping to get in the lead there with 79 and Croatia and Malta, close, Malta closely behind in third place. Still to score though, Greece, France, Switzerland and Finland. Let's see what Ireland brings. Eileen, can you hear me? Yes, indeed. Good evening, Ulrika. Good evening, Birmingham. Dublin calling. And here are the votes of the Irish jury. Estonia, one point. Estonia, one point. L'Estonie, un point. Sweden, two points. Sweden, two points. La Suède, deux points. Croatia, three points. Croatia, three points. La Croatie, trois points. Norway, four points. Norway, four points. La Norvège, quatre points. United Kingdom, five points. The United Kingdom, five points. Le Royaume-Uni, cinq points. Not great. Israel, six points. Israel, six points. Israel, six points. Belgium, seven points. Belgium, seven points. La Belgique, sept points. Germany, eight points. Germany, eight points. L'Allemagne, eight said musical points. discrimination was dead in Ireland. Netherlands, ten points. The Netherlands, ten points. Le That's Pays good Bas, marks for Netherlands. Who's getting the 12? And finally, Malta, 12 points. That's good. Malta, 12 points. And Malta in the lead. One point over Netherlands. And that As Ulrika said, this is one of the closest for years. Good night. Good night, Aline. As we always thought it would be. Changing here virtually by Israel in third Let's place. To Portugal. And Croatia, Buonite, United Lucia. Kingdom, still in fifth position. Hi, how are you? We're very well. Very I excited. To <laughs> I have to congratulate you on uh, the great show you had before the, the sports. Thank you, it's been a terrific show. <laughs> Beautiful. And let me say a few words in Portuguese, please. Oh, all right. Beijinho à Inês, beijinho ao Rui Unas e à Alma Lusa, parabéns a todos. Okay, and now, <laughs> here are the results of the Portuguese vote. I think it's a bit much to okay. be sending greetings to your mother Ireland, on international television. Ireland, one point. Ireland, one point. L'Irlande, un point. Croatia, two points. Croatia, two points. La Croatie, deux points. 
Norway, three points. Norway, three points. La Norvège, trois points. Cyprus, four points. Cyprus, four points. Chypre, quatre points. Malta, five points. Malta, five points. That will be points. a disappointing Malte, mark for Malta points. from Portugal. And for you, United Kingdom, six points. And we're United not too Kingdom, thrilled about six that. Six points. Le Royaume-Uni, six points. Still. I've done nothing. And uh, the Netherlands, seven points. The Netherlands, seven points. Les Pays-Bas, sept points. Belgium, eight points. Belgium, eight points. La Belgique, huit points. Germany, ten points. Germany, ten points. L'Allemagne, dix points. And uh, Israel. Israel got it. Israel, Twelve, 12 points. points. Go into the lead again. Two points over Netherlands. Thank you. Then Malta, a point behind the Netherlands, then the United Kingdom. So fast, let's just take a look now at who's in the lead. And once again, Israel find themselves in the lead. But the Netherlands very close behind, just two points behind, and followed very, very closely indeed by Malta. Right, let's go to Romania. Buona Sierra Anka. And I have to say, happy birthday. Oh, thank you very much, Ulrika. Good evening, Birmingham. Here is Bucharest, and those are the results of the Romanian jury. Hungary, one point. Hungary, one point. L'Hongrie, un point. Turkey, two points. Turkey, two points. La Turquie, deux points. Macedonia, three points. The former Yugoslav Republic of Macedonia, three points. L'ex Republic Yugoslav de Macedoine, trois points. Cyprus, four points. Cyprus, four points. Chypre, quatre points. Slovenia, five points. Slovenia, five points. La Slovenie, cinq points. Germany, six points. Germany, six points. La Germany Mani, has been climbing points. up the ladder. Israel, seven points. Israel, seven points. Israel, seven points. Is that going to be enough to hold off the Netherlands and Malta? Ireland, eight points. Oh, that's the most Ireland, points for Ireland. Eight points. Ireland, eight points. They've moved up from tenth place with that. Poland, ten points. Poland, ten points. La Pologne, ten points. And finally, United Kingdom. <laughs> I was just about to say those are very eccentric marks from Romania. And stop me, Michael. Puts the United Kingdom into second place along with the Netherlands. Israel at 105. Have a very good end to your birthday. Then UK, Netherlands. Well, mixed pleasure. Malta, one point behind that. Then Croatia. Bruce, good evening to you, Ken. How you doing? And here's old Ken. Just as mixed for me. But it's good fun. This is terribly exciting. It is great. It's just changing by the second. I just wasn't expecting this at all. Fantastic. Well, let's see. My makeup girl, you know, has looked after him. What a difference it's made. Sweden, one point. Sweden, one point. La Suède, un point. Croatia, two points. Croatia, two points. La Croatie, deux points. Cyprus, three points. Cyprus, three points. Chypre, trois points. Norway, four points. Norway, four points. La Norvège, quatre points. Israel, five points. Israel, five points. Israel, cinq points. Who are the great British public going to give the 12 points to? Points. Germany, <laughs> They gave six, six points, points to Germany. Belgium, seven points. Belgium, seven points. La Belgique, sept points. Ireland, eight points. Ireland, eight points. L'Irlande, huit points. Netherlands, ten points. The Netherlands, ten good points. Ten the Netherlands. Points. Who's going to get the top mark points. from the UK? And finally, twelve points to Malta. Malta 12 hey, good for that. Well, oh, that has kept it tremendously close. Thank you, Ken. Thanks very much, Ken. I love you lots. See you later. Israel in the lead by three over Malta. Then Netherlands, then the UK. Kalispera Ulrike. Hello to everyone from Cyprus. Here is how the people of Cyprus televoted tonight. France, one point. France, 
Hey, France have been zero, one of the zero ones. Now it's only Greece, Switzerland and Finland have no point. Portugal, two points. Le Portugal, two points. Norway, three points. Norway, three points. La Norvège, trois points. Spain, four points. Spain, four points. L'Espagne, quatre points. Malta, five points. Malta, five points. Malte, cinq points. Belgium, six points. Belgium, six points. La Belgique, six points. Croatia, seven points. Croatia, seven points. La Croatie, sept points. United Kingdom, eight points. Good United march from Kingdom, Cyprus for the UK. Points. The Royaume-Uni, eight points. Israel, ten points. Israel, ten points. Israel, ten points. And twelve points from Cyprus to Greece. Greece, well, twelve points. Well, horror. That's a shock. That is a shock. This has never happened before, I think, in the history of the Eurovision, that Cyprus has given 12 points to Greece. That, I'm astounded by this. On our leaderboard, Israel... Swipe me. Well, ahead there on 120, Malta and the Netherlands behind, and Greece finally receiving some points as well, which is good news. Let's go to the Netherlands, Gordon Arvind Connie. Hello, Birmingham. Hello, Ulrika. This is Hilversum calling. Before I start giving you my points, I should like uh, to say that my heart goes to all the singers in the contest because I know what they feel. What about a song from yourself you, while you're there? I hmm? have taken part, so you must be it's feeling their nerves. <laughs> yes. A long time ago, was it? <laughs> no, I didn't Do you want to know? Yes, of course you are. Now, can Here we get over this quickly? Of the Dutch vote. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh. Turkey, one point. Turkey, one point. <laughs> La Turquie, un point. Estonia, two points. You wait Estonia, until I get that girl on points. the stage. Estonia, two points. Norway, three points. Norway, three points. La Norvège, trois points. Croatia, four points. Croatia, four points. La Croatie, quatre points. Sweden, five points. Sweden, five points. La Suède, cinq points. Israel, six points. Israel, six points. Israel, six points. United Kingdom, seven points. I was going to say United Israel would have expected Kingdom, more points, points than so seven would the UK. Points. Malta, eight points. Malta, eight points. Malta, eight points. Belgium, ten points. Belgium, ten points. That was La our Belgique, sneaky little outsider from Belgium. And twelve points two. go from Holland to Germany. Germany, twelve points. <laughs> There's a sort of mazy charm about the whole thing, and this isn't completes it? The point of the Dutch folks. Thank you very much, he's Tommy. Like a, he's like bye a bye. Teutonic puppy, bye bye. isn't he? And now we go to my home country of Sweden. Kokvel, Björn. Hey, Ulrika. Who's Hello, Brom. Brum. <laughs> Brum. Oh, very good. That's very good. So, yeah, here is Malmö <laughs> and the result of the Swedish votes. Ireland one point. Ireland, one point. Ireland, one point. It's not going to be Ireland's year this Belgium, year. Is it going to be the UK's? Points. Belgium, two points. La Belgique, two points. Oh, more than likely, Croatia, is it going to be Israel or three Malta? Points. Croatia, three points. La Croatie, trois points. Estonia, four points. Estonia, four points. L'Estonie, quatre points. Israel, Five points. Israel, five points. Israel, cinq points. Malta, six points. Malta, six points. That still Malte, keeps it very close. There's United only five Kingdom, points between them. Seven points. United Moves Kingdom, the UK seven up a bit. Points. Sept points. Netherlands, eight points. The Netherlands, eight points. Les Pays-Bas, huit points. And then we're breaking a Nordic egg here. Finland. 10 points. Finland, 10 points. This is Finland, not a tremendous points. shock to me. I and 
Call me an old cynic. 12 points to Norge. Norway. And, oh no. Norway. Not 12 Norway. points to Norway from Sweden. Well. That's all from Sweden. I mean, I, the voting Let's here is always a such a surprise. That's changed things after our votes from Sweden. Israel, Israel in the lead. lead. Now with 131. And if I'm not mistaken, yes, that was Finland's first point. Not bad to start, though. 10 points. Let's go to Belgium. Bonsoir, Marie-Hélène. Bonsoir, Urlika. Bonsoir, Birmingham. Ici, Bruxelles. Voici les résultats des votes de la Belgique. Portugal, un point. Portugal, un point. Portugal, one point. Chypre, deux points. Chypre, deux points. Cyprus, two points. Espagne, trois points. Espagne, trois points. Spain, three points. Norvège, quatre points. Norvège, quatre points. Norway, four points. Croatie, cinq points. Croatie, cinq points. Croatia, five points. Royaume-Uni, 6 points. Le Royaume-Uni, 6 points. United more Kingdom, 6 points. At this Allemagne, stage, 7 points. L'Allemagne, 7 points. Germany, 7 points. Malte, 8 points. Malte, 8 points. Good points Malta, from Malta, put them points. on the top. Israel, 10 points. Oh, they've Israel, just been shifted off it again. Israel, 10 points. Et Pays-Bas, 12 points. And 12 points for the Netherlands, putting them in third place, pushing down the United Kingdom to fourth position. Does seem to be between Israel and Malta. And now we go to Finland. Hyve Ilte Mario. Hyve Ilta. Good evening, Birmingham, Ulrika, and all Europe. The votes from Finland are Germany, one point. Germany, one point. L'Allemagne, un point. Norway, two points. Norway, two points. La Norvège, deux points. Croatia, three points. Croatia, three points. La Croatie, trois points. Slovenia, four points. Slovenia, four points. La Slovenie, quatre points. Malta, five points. Malta, five points. Malte, Cinq How many points. are they going to give to Israel? Sweden, six points. Sweden, six points. La Suède, six points. The Netherlands, seven points. The Netherlands, seven points. Les Pays-Bas, sept points. United King, eight points. The United Kingdom, eight points. Le Royaume-Uni, huit points. Israel, ten points. Israel, ten points. They're beginning Israel, to stretch away points. from Malta. Estonia, 12 points. 12 points Estonia, to Estonia 12 points. from Finland. That's not a tremendous Estonia, shock either. Good night. Good night, Mario. Israel Thank in the lead. Let's make our way and it's a wider gap Norway, between Israel and Malta. Then the Netherlands and then the United Thank Kingdom have been fighting out third and fourth position between themselves. It's really between these Norway. four countries now. We UK, Netherlands, Malta, Israel. And our first point goes to... Finland. Finland, one point. La Finlande, un point. Hungary, two points. Hungary, two points. L'Hongrie, deux points. Israel, three points. Israel, three points. Israel, that might change points. things. We'll see what Malta gets. Ireland, four points. Ireland, four points. L'Irlande, quatre points. United Kingdom, Five points. The United Kingdom, five points. Le Royaume-Uni, cinq points. I thought the Norwegians were supposed to be the UK's six friends. Points. Croatia, six points. La Croatie, six points. Belgium, seven points. Belgium, seven points. La Belgique, sept points. Netherlands, eight points. The Netherlands, eight points. The Netherlands Les have been scoring well, points. sort of six, sevens and eights with everybody, but not enough America. to win it, I think. Sweden. 10 points. Oh. 10 points. La Suède, 10 points. Well, nobody can accuse the Scandinavian countries and of finally, pulling together. Malta, 12 points. Malta, 12 points. Malta, That's made it right up and close again. There's the girl herself, Chiara.
<laughs> this is the best malt I've ever done. This is the best song they've ever had in. A nice song. There's three points between the Maltese entry and the Israeli entry. Then it's the Netherlands dropping a bit behind and the UK just a little bit behind the Netherlands. Thank you for the wonderful show. We've enjoyed it a lot. And we are now ready to give you the results of the Estonian vote. Here they come. Germany, one point. Germany, one point. L'Allemagne, un point. Ireland, two points. Ireland, two points. L'Irlande, deux points. Croatia, three points. Croatia, three points. La Croatie, trois points. Norway, four points. Norway, four points. La Norvège, quatre points. Malta, five points. Malta, five Not points. what Malta were looking for. Cinq points. Belgium, six points. Belgium, six points. La Belgique, six points. Israel, seven points. Israel, seven points. Israel, six points. United Kingdom, eight points. The United Kingdom, eight points. Le Royaume-Uni, huit points. Finland, ten points. Finland, ten points. The Finland, Finland ten points. points, eh? And finally, <laughs> Sweden, twelve <laughs> points. Okay. Well, a Swedish song is a good song. She's a good singer. She's in ninth position now. Israel are in top. Thank you. 161. Thank you five ahead of it. Malta, 156. And Israel still clinging on to the top there with 161 points. United Kingdom having moved up to third place. And we're still looking at Switzerland for some scores. Let's go to Turkey now. Merhaba, Osman. Merhaba, Birmingham. Hello, Birmingham. Good evening. Ankara calling. And here are the results of the Turkish jury. Belgium, one point. Belgium, one point. La Belgique, un point. Sweden, two points. Sweden, this, I remind you, points. is the penultimate vote. Only one more set of votes Slovenia, after this. Slovenia, three points. Slovenia, three points. La Slovenie, trois points. Croatia, four points. Croatia, four points. Israel, five points. Do you know, I think we lost, we lost Turkey points. there, I thought, for just a second. It's still there, through dungeon, Portugal, fire and sword. Six points. Portugal, six points. Portugal, six points. Netherlands, seven points. The Netherlands, seven points. Les Pays-Bas, seven points. Ireland, eight points. Ireland, eight points. Good Ireland, points for Ireland from Turkey. Moving them up a bit. Malta. They're in ninth points. position. Malta, ten, ten points, points to Malta ten, from points. Turkey. That puts them level with Israel, unless and they finally, give Israel the 12. And finally, 12 points to the United Kingdom. Oh. United Kingdom this is probably the closest Eurovision Song Contest scoring I have ever seen. God knows I've been doing it long enough. Israel and Malta and neck and neck, 166. It's changing. down to the wire. Literally There's only one more set of votes Israel coming up. And Malta really, really battling it out. It can and only be won by Israel and Malta. Making good use well, you never know. UK points. is there with 157 and third place, doing very well. Evening, and then the, the Netherlands. Of this Dobro is really a thriller. Good evening, Birmingham. Good evening, Europe. This is Kopje calling. First of all, I would like to thank you for this magnificent and Come on, come show. on, girl. Thank Stop you. building up the suspense. To you and to all the organizers. It was a pleasant evening, really. You're driving the public us. insane. Good. But let's work now. <laughs> yes, let's get to work. Uh, this is uh, how the citizens of Republic of Macedonia have voted. First point, go to... Finland. Finland, one point. La Finland, un point. France, two points. France, two points. La France, deux points. The Netherlands, three points. The Netherlands, three points. Is anybody Le going to give Switzerland Bas, anything? Points. Portugal, four points. Portugal, four points. Portugal, quatre points. Turkey, Five points. Turkey, five points. La Turquie, cinq points. 
Belgium, six points. Belgium, six points. La Belgique, six points. Ireland, seven points. Ireland, seven points. This is, Ireland, this is points. getting a bit nail biting now. Israel, eight points. Oh, eight points to Israel. Does this mean Walters won it? Come on, strike United a light. Kingdom, ten points. Ten United points to the United Kingdom, Kingdom points, pushing it into so second Mario place. Who's going to get the 12? And finally, 12 points from Macedonia goes to Croatia. 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 Israel have won it. Israel have won it by seven points over the United Kingdom. I'm afraid I've got to love you and leave you. I've got a fish to fry. Moments hiatus. Obviously, the winners are celebrated not wisely but too well. In a long time. Go on, quickly, quickly, come on. Go on, quickly. Come on, quickly, let's go. We must go where you're looking at me on. You must go. Who's a pretty girl then? <laughs> Thank you. I knew I should have worn my Jean Paul Gaultier. As this year's competition draws to a close, and what an exciting and wonderful one it was. It only reminds us to thank the hundreds of people who organized it, taken part, and to the millions of you who followed into votes. To tout le monde à Birmingham, merci à tous nos téléspectateurs et bonne nuit. Yeah, we look forward to gathering next year in Israel. We wish you a very good night from Birmingham. Our congratulations to Dada International.
International, the winning song and diva. Dana, this could be the peak of her career. Others, meanwhile, are lost in a veil of tears and sick. Uh, I, I, I'm not going to stop here or anywhere. I'm going to fight this situation for all my life. Even 10, 10 years past, 20 years, I don't need this Eurovision song for this for me. <laughs> <laughs>